Hello and welcome back to podcast. No, Mason, you're supposed to say Misfits podcast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Hello, oh, and welcome back to the Misfits so podcast. Rated five stars on <laughs> iTunes by Jack the Lad One Two Three. He says, "I got the words jacuzzi and yakuzzi. Now I'm in hot water with the Japanese mafia." Oh no, Jack! <laughs> hey, <laughs> holy shit! Damn. Up, bro. Yakuzzi. I'm, I'm sure he stole that joke, but I think it's pretty funny. Yeah, that's it's pretty good. Uh, I don't get it. Uh, of course you don't. The Yakuza is the Japanese mafia, and it sounds like uh, a jacuzzi, which is a hot tub filled with hot water. And then he's saying he's in hot water with the Yakuzzi. What the heck that. even is the Japanese uh, okay. mafia? I'm clearly like, joined today by Mason and Jay. G'day Yo, guys. hello. What's going and on, the, bro? And the rest We're pretty silly and dumb. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know... Pretty silly and wacky. <laughs> Just a and couple of wacky and zany guys. And Toby's here. Hi. Swagger's here. Hello. Matt Blair. How do you do, fellow podcasters? And I'm here. It's the Six Misfits, the original crew. The wow. Six. They can it all. The gang is gang. all here. Three, four, five, six. Over two years ago, we started, you know, manifesting the Misfits <laughs> Corporation on Discord. You remember that, guys? Yeah, I do. Mm. Yep. Remember that yeah. back when we all lived in our standard positions in the world? Swagger and Matt still in America. Yep. Myself, Toby, and Jay still in New Zealand. Mason. Mm -hmm. Yep. On the streets. Everything was going well. Then it all went downhill. <laughs> yeah, we were up. Yeah. We were up for a while. Uh, what do you mean up for a while? Up for a dude? while, bro. Okay, we're still we're up right now. Man, we're still up. <laughs> it's just up uh, shit, it's, just, it's just stuff that's slowing us down yeah. at the moment. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. I'm not saying this we're year, down. This year is null and void as far as I'm concerned. Okay, guys, this year is just... Yeah, can count. we have a do-over? When it strikes midnight on New Year's... No, we do. It's 2020, 2020 again, dude. Fitz had to tweet about it. I'm actually yeah. full down. <laughs> I do not I'm want to do over, down. dude. I want to fucking... I want to delete and move on. <laughs> just skip. What if <laughs> just it's, skip just it's like Groundhog's Day, but every year is just 2020. Uh, Bro, how funny would it be thing. if we legit just took 2020 off the count? So it's just 2019 and then 2021. <laughs> That'd be so funny. Yeah, Surely that. we do that. Yeah, surely we do that. I'll actually I'll put in a word, Jay. I'll make yeah. that happen. Who's in charge of that? Oh, I am. Oh, it's yeah, so weird. I don't know why I am, but I am. It's one of those things. I'm just resp I'm responsible for a lot of things you guys don't know about. When did you like, like what position? Oh, like cancer. First of all, I'm responsible. Really? For that. Really? Yeah, that's, that was you. Asshole. Yeah, that you was haven't me. gotten rid of that yet. Yeah. Why are you keeping him around? Yeah, why is that position no, still I was going to start that up. I just thought it'd be a good meme. A lot of money in pharmaceuticals. That's why. Hey, that's for sure. Chemotherapy. You just milk those fuckers. So good. Yeah, it's it's another environment right there. It's global cool. warming. <laughs> another thing. Global I'm warming as well. For. Wow. Yeah. What the fuck? I've been Holy slowly shit. warming the globe. I don't know why I've just decided to come out with this information today of all days, but I feel like yeah. you, you know. sound like you just done fucked up everything, mate. Wait, so what's wait, going whoa, on? whoa, whoa! Your definition of, definition of fucked up and mine are clearly different, Mason. Yeah. No, 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 no. He's got a point. When I'm ten drinks deep on the dance floor on a Saturday night, all right. Look, we're talking about <laughs> global warming and cancer here. There's nothing fucked up about it. Just it's just God's way. Okay, I started these things out of the kindness of my heart, and you should. What are you saying? Them. You're God now. I'm okay, not saying I appreciate I'm God. It. I'm saying God speaks through me. Uh, wow, that was saying? poetic. Uh, well, at the moment he's actually having a wank, but I'm sure. He <laughs> <laughs> Is he like on hold? Is there like elevator music when you got to talk to him and he's not there and he's just no. like busting a wank? Yeah, you got to call him. It's like a private uh, number. And he's got the secretary. Can I have his Her number? Um, no. No. Okay. What? what about That's May? so selfish. Mason, Mason can have it, but yeah, not. Totally. Yes, dude. Yes. Bro, he needs to go. Anyone here? Yeah. Yeah, please, please man. I mean, what, what, <laughs> where you at, bro? What would you say to God if you could call him right now, Miss? I'd say, uh, how long till the Earth's finished or some shit? It finishes and finished being done or like over? Like over, like <laughs> like it's gone. When, like kaput. Yeah, like. When, yeah, pretty much, yeah. What's it oh. called? The fucking the day everyone dies or whatever? Everyone Apocalypse. Goes, Apocalypse. The rapture. No, the rapture, that's uh, it. The best day ever. The, the best day ever. <laughs> SpongeBob the themed it. Day, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, the day of reckoning. It'd be kind you of know? fun. I'd, I'd have a boogie. Wrecked. Yeah, I do a lot of reckoning all, all day. Yeah, reckoning kids on Fortnite. No, I just like reckon heaps of stuff. <laughs> yeah, you reckon? <laughs> I reckon. Yeah. Yeah. Heaps I reckon. of reckoning. Yeah, I reckon. You're reckoning. Oh, I reckon the world's mm. ending. I reckon. Yeah. Reckon. <laughs> like, no, oh, no shit. Like, <laughs> oh what does reckoning God. mean? Um, like you wreck shit. Well, what, you mean in the apocalyptic sense? I guess. What is reckoning? All right. Let me um, consult Google. What is. Come on, magic does internet. Reckoning mean. 
Um, the action uh, or I process of calculating or no, estimating the, something. The avenging or punishment of past mistakes or misdeeds. Ah, okay, so that's what it means. So it's behavior, basically like God coming going down to heaven and, or hell, and yeah, fucking us up for all of our sins. Um, God can and believe me, anytime he wants. It'd be a lot of <laughs> sins going on. <laughs> You want to get fucked up by God, Toby? I want to get yeah. No, like, yeah. You may you may be God, but I want to call you Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I mean, he is no, the father is of all things. Too. Jesus, how'd hey, you dude. know? No, I would make God call me Daddy. Oh, you're, and, you're a oh, Jesus. Imagine, dude, people are praying. They go, "Our Daddy who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name." Fuck, man. Fuck. That's right. Our Daddy. Jesus Christ. <laughs> and the the hail. Uh, bitch. I don't know. That's... Mary, bro. I... Mary, bro. Like, are you serious? I don't know. I, I grew up Catholic, but I never said I grew up smart. Okay, I don't retain knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> we none of us have sinned, so we're all going to heaven. I've yeah. never yeah. sinned yeah. in my life. Never oh sinned. yeah. Never, oh never, fuck. Never. I've just realized oh, I'm living what? in sin constantly. What never do you mean? Uh, what? I just what? do a sin lot of city. sins. Oh uh, yeah. Ah, okay. uh, Cincinnati is a uh, the yeah. city of sin. Sin yep. City. I think it's known for that. I think it's that's its catchphrase. Yeah, Cincinnati, city of, city of sin. Isn't that a zoo? <laughs> no, <laughs> Cincinnati Zoo. No, there is a zoo, no, there is a zoo. It's in a city called Cincinnati. Oh, I thought that's what it was called. Isn't that where Cincinnati Harambe zoo. died? Oh, rest of oh is yes. it? Oh, oh, my is, God. Isn't that where is that's it? where I'm getting that from. All right, is everyone is the city of sin. City of sin. They killed Harambe. Get, you're talking about Sin City, but I'm just thinking about Madagascar, man. Guys. Cincinnati is spelt with a C. Wow. You didn't oh, know that? Really? Oh. It's not a, I thought it was sin as in S I N. No. And <laughs> that's why that's why Harambe got shot because he committed a sin. Yeah. He was in Cincinnati. He, he died was, for like, our sins. He died yeah, for Harambe our Cincinnati's, bro. Yeah, <laughs> no way. Yeah. Everyone, get your cock that, Everyone get your cock champ for Harambe. Already oh, gone, mate. Oh, no. <laughs> Mason, <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, Flashbacks, bro. In 2016, when a three year old boy climbed into a gorilla enclosure wow. at the Cincinnati Zoo. What a dumb wow. car. Is that a 16 year old boy? Six, no, he was three years old. He was oh, grabbed. Uh. No, it says three year old. He was three? Yeah, what and he was also better. grabbed and dragged by Harambe, a 17 year old Western lowland gorilla. He was only seventeen. The... Oh, so Dude, young. He sad. died a minor, so, bro. Like what? Li, li, like what? What's really the problem here with Karambe dying? All right, let me just play devil's advocate. Whoa, whoa, He's whoa, whoa, whoa. Look, you're, imagine this: you're the guard on duty. You see a three-year-old child in the enclosure being grabbed by a seventeen-year-old gorilla. That's almost a legal adult. That's kind yeah, of weird. Yeah, that is that is story, right? But you have to put into context the perspective of a gorilla of the and how gorillas oh, I think actually the perspective operate. Of the guard. Uh, okay. So gorillas. Uh, especially with your young, if they want to take them away from danger, they often just grab mm. their limbs and drag them. Uh, and then okay. when he dragged the, the child over to the wall, uh, he just kind of sat around and looked at him and, and was like taking care of him. Uh, so uh -huh. it didn't look like he was actually in inflicting any kind of, you know, pain on the kid <laughs> besides the, the it, initial it, is drag. It, is it worth the risk? Hey, I, yes. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't care, really. I mean, what's it, done is done. They could have just used a trank. They could have just used a yeah, trank. Yeah, did they have gun, to man. shoot him? They couldn't well, have tased him? Well, they just didn't have. It was just like a, a split second decision, okay? And think about this poor guy having to deal with the, the guilt and also having Where to rip his own dick off. Well, maybe. What if the god. Maybe a trank on. gun. Uh, they, would, they would be worried that a trank gun would agitate it because you would assume there'd be a bit of time Ooh. before the trank actually starts working, right? Yeah, it's not like the movies where it's just like, yeah. and you're like knocked out, you know? Yeah, he'd be startled and he might... And he might you know, kill the kid. Might kill the kid. Well, what but was why? started out as just a bit of a drag might have turned into like more of a throw across the enclosure yeah. into the middle fence. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Could yeah. You could imagine that. He could have thrown so him to the lion's den at that point. Imagine that. You'll see a three-year-old boy flying through the air <laughs> at the Cincinnati the Zoo as Harambe tosses him an alarm. <laughs> Holy fuck. Imagine that's what could have happened. Imagine, imagine you're decided you're gonna like take acid that day and then like take a nice casual, uh, casual stroll through the zoo just to see all the animals and shit while tripping. Uh -huh. and you see that shit. <laughs> you see a fucking a child flying through the air. Like, oh fuck. Yeah, that would be incredible. <laughs> and you turn into a falcon. <laughs> I could never fly gracefully into the sunset. I could never go to the zoo on <laughs> acid, shit. dude. I would never be able to do mm. it. I wouldn't be able to go anywhere yeah, in public on acid. You'd be acid. stuck at like the chimp cage or something. You'd be like trying to. Talk yeah, to I'd you. just be like putting my putting <laughs> my hand <laughs> to the glass like. 
This I am me. a monkey too. I am. Monkey. We're all monkeys. I am monkey. Monkey. Or I just I start screaming. We pimp chimping and making monkey noises until I'm escorted out of the zoo. What? <laughs> what? what? Yeah, when we go to the zoo anyway. I do, <laughs> but I'd be on acid, so it'd be different. <laughs> what? What? Uh, what is happening at the zoos now with COVID going on? Are they still like open? Or yeah, all the monkeys, all the all the animals need to wear masks. It's mandatory. Oh, yeah? oh, oh I actually, I actually have seen. Uh, a lot of zoos, uh, because there's, they're not having any guests, the zookeepers are like taking them on walk. Their yeah, animals are so walks penguins. around the zoos. Mm -hmm. So they took the penguins around to see the other animals. It was what? so cute. Bro, so like, cute. They're like Very letting cute. the animals no clip through the map and see everything else on the other side. That would be yeah. so outside weird. The walls and shit. It's a small world after all, man. Yeah, they live in a cage. Can, can they get the little spiders out? Do, do you guys have like those spider enclosures at your zoo? Yeah, no. Zoo where, like it's tarantulas and stuff. What? Do they walk the tarantulas? I hope on so. Little leash, <laughs> I would love. A little string. I, I want a tarantula on a leash. <laughs> That'd be so funny. <laughs> I want a really big fucking spider. Like, what's the biggest spider ever? Anyone know? Okay. Oh, oh god, I do tarantula? not want to know. Like a bird eating spider or something? Yeah. I, I mean, I have seen a a, a hawk eating tarantula. Yeah. Uh, the the Goliath. Hawk eating. Oh, yeah. The Goliath yeah. bird eater. What the fuck? There's no way it's that's South, real. It's South yeah, American. Yeah, it's here's here's a fucking picture Goliath. of the thing. Yeah, they're, they're fucking huge. Here's a, here's a fucking picture oh. right here. Is there a picture? Is yeah, this compared to a hand. Fucking... That's yeah, so fuck. it's like, that is fuck. It's like four oh. times the size of this man's large hand. Yeah. I'm arachnophobic. It's better than some dogs, dude. You no. could actually pet that thing and put it on a leash. Fuck that. Yeah, absolutely. Oh. Absolutely. Did, anyone else, jumps. did anyone else kind of like... Like their fear of spiders began with the Harry Potter film. The uh, the uh, it didn't Chamber help. Secrets. It didn't yeah. stop, but it didn't help. <laughs> it didn't help, you know, dude. Like... I remember playing the uh, the Chamber of Secrets video game on PC, and um, fucking like I had to get my dad to beat the uh, spider really? boss level because oh, it was shit. so big and scary, and, and there was too low polygon count for me to, you know, yeah, do that shit on my own. It was it was crazy. Fuck but, that. I mean, yeah, surely would the boys get big Goliath birding and spiders and go on cute little yeah. walks together through the park. It sounds like epic. It's going to get over the fear. We put them I in reckon I've got, I reckon I've dead ass got arachnophobia. Like, I just same don't like yeah, spiders. Yeah, same. I hate You guys I are hate so spiders. intolerant, dude. No, like, I will <laughs> actually... <laughs> if a spider gets on me, I will squeal, man. Same like, here. I will literally squeal. If I see wow. a big spider, dude, I have to kill it. I have to kill it. Like that time in Sydney. <laughs> Yeah, dude, that fucking giant spider, dude. <laughs> Fuck that. That shit was so funny. Mm. <laughs> trying to ex We're just trying hitting to get it, it with pillows, trying to throw fucking pillows at it to knock it off the wall. It was holding oh its ground. It was really holding its ground. And it was by my <laughs> dude, I just remembered both times we saw um, spiders, it was that one Airbnb, and then it was the one place we went to where it was like that massive spider you killed with like the oh, pole or whatever. Yeah. Oh I remember both times, yeah. I just didn't give a fuck about the spider. The Airbnb, I was like trying to sleep in the bed. You guys are like freaking out, chasing a spider right down the hallway. And then the other one, I was like oh, right. sitting there eating breakfast. I was too fucking hungry to get up. Whoa! Like I saw a guy. Recent studies have found that Matt has the biggest balls of anyone. <laughs> Bro, I, I was like, I'm either <laughs> too tired fuck. or too hungry to give a fuck about a spider. <laughs> too man. tired. I saw a guy eat a fucking spider on TikTok today, oh. like full eight. Oh, what the it, fuck! It was like. It was some Aussie boy. It was like it was like massive, dude. It didn't look healthy. Wait, was it no way. Look healthy at all? It's gonna get yeah, it was what live. The fuck? Yeah, it was. Oh. He just ate it and rinsed it down with a beer. <laughs> with a beer. <BB. laughs> but the spider yum, was still yum. alive in his stomach, making a little hammock. I have no idea, man. But I would like to know where the end of that story Can, happened. Imagine Probably like shitting the, the spider out, still alive, and his little legs come out your ass first. Like it bites you right in the rectum. No. no. <laughs> Sorry to anyone who's got arachnophobia. Nah. Comes in like a shit cocoon, like it just comes out of oh, shit. <laughs> like, it just stays in your stomach, and all your cocoon. shits come out with like cobweb. Now you're like no, a like cursed little... Spider-Man. You shoot <sighs> web out your ass. Oh my god! Like a little poo, it crawls out of the poo like all right, a all right. spider <laughs> cocoon. <laughs> like, I, think I regret bringing up the the, the yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm guys... so arachnophobic. I can't even watch Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on, man! <laughs> yeah, it's true. Who can't, who can't watch Spider? -Man? I have a Let's similar problem. Real. I actually can't watch Spider Man because I hate uh, straight men. So um, you know, like that's that's my personal plight right now. <laughs> that's, uh, fair. No, that's fair. No, that's nothing to do with the fact that he's a spider. It's just I can't stand those kinds. <laughs> Guys, oh if, a, if, if a little meteor landed in your backyard uh, tomorrow and inside it contained alien life. And let's say it's like a cute little guy, maybe like slightly arachnid looking, that can talk to you in its alien language. Do you uh, harbor the 
extraterrestrial being. Or Wait, you say total being? Do we Inhabit. understand what it's saying? I mean, maybe like if you turn subtitles on. Okay. Mm, that yeah. helps. Yeah, but other than that, like it's just kind of speaking gibberish. But maybe you can like learn its language. Maybe it'll teach you the. I'd Harvard, dude, for sure. Language. I want to be the first person to know, like all the yeah. ancient alien yeah. tech and, and all the, I don't know, all the secrets. But or like, I could have this... a disease, uh, and I would be patient zero. So I'd probably quarantine. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> yeah! Imagine if COVID's actually from space. It's actually just an holy alien. shit. Well, space surprise me, COVID. Man. Space or space, space, space AIDS. I just two hands over the head, double hammer fist. <laughs> no. yeah, really? Wild. You'd actually? Yeah. No yeah. way. I just have to, man. No. I'd be like, no. Nah. Nah, nah, first you. contact, he runs into like the first aliens contact. Nah, because like manage. the whole concept of aliens, bro, is if they're coming here, they're coming in peace, yeah, you know? Yeah, I don't know. They come up, they rock up, they do this shit, <laughs> and it's like, yeah, we're nah, cool, like, yeah. bro fist. Yeah, so you bash him over the head with a rock, that's your response? Well, if he's in a media, I'm like, where the fuck did this little shit come from just yeah but what bang. if he comes out like like that what if he does that yeah, first? He does. like i come in peace does he know what peace well is then though? yeah yeah okay it'll be a different story then obviously yeah <laughs> no that's what correct. i reckon as well i, I honestly obviously. think if alien if aliens landed in my backyard i would 100 percent grab the shittiest quality camera i possibly could and then videotape it and then put it <laughs> online Really yeah. shaky footage. Yeah, <laughs> shaky blurry i'll put it through my uh, through premiere and just add some guys in blur mm -hmm. perfect Perfect. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. Just everyone will believe me, conspiracy. dude. It's, it's real footage. <laughs> fuck. I don't know, man. I feel like realistically, what the fuck are you going to do? You're going to hide. You're going to hide. You're going to peer at it through your windows. You're going to watch it crawling out of its little meteor. You're going to be peering through the curtain. Like, oh my God, what the fuck is that? Like, why did yeah. this have to happen to me? And maybe depending on how cute it is, you might approach. Yeah. After like some time. Like, have you seen the movie Paul? Yeah. Like that alien was fucking mad. Yeah. Paul, like, oh, he was he was he was a good movie. cunt. Yeah, and that's like that shit talking alien, right? That's yeah, like if it's really... a Paul alien, then I'm full down to just like hang out with it. But if it's <laughs> yeah, a fuck yeah, like yeah. from pre aliens versus it. Predator, yeah, up. take so, a couple then, bongs. With them. So basically, <laughs> if the aliens wearing cargo shorts, it's it's safe. It's like, fine. Like, <laughs> like, like shit, we're, we're chill. We're chill. <laughs> but if it's all fucked up, like aliens versus Predator, no way. <laughs> Kill on sight. Kill on sight. It was. <laughs> what if the Paul looking one's actually the evil one though? And what if the alien vs predator looking one's actually chill? Like don't judge a book by its cover, I say. You know. Bro, but like give it a chance. I've the seen Alien vs Predator. What if it's really hot? <laughs> Ooh. We got changes a lot. What if it's really hot? Like and you're really horny due to COVID. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh my god, we got a fucking alien. Oh yeah. Really we got a alien. Like the entire Holy thing just shit. looks like just it's mm, got like, like three tits snack. or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> oh my or it's, god. Or it's like well, a, what what's the definition of hot when it comes to an alien? Just exactly like? what you're looking for. <laughs> <laughs> exactly what you're looking for, except blue. <laughs> except slightly tinted blue. Yeah. It's like a um. What are they called? The uh, mermaids, like sirens. Where oh they, yeah, yeah. They yeah, chant you and make it look like your greatest desire, and then you'll snap out of it, and it's actually this disgusting sea beast. Yeah. yeah no, that's just oh, post night no. clarity, mate. That's normal. That's post night clarity. Just, yeah, you nut and you just find out it's the oh, Jesus. sea beast. I hate it when that happens every time. You sober up. Like, <laughs> the fuck? I remember. Stop picking up girls by the ocean. <laughs> 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 Drenched in seaweed. Uh, they smell weird. Fucking cockle shells. Uh, oh, I just saw Swagger's cat and my heart melted. Oh. Yeah, it was just behind you. Yep. Cat. Yeah. Anyway. But did you ever get a pet? Yeah. Yeah. You've said you wanted a dog, right? I've said I wanted a dog. Oh, yeah, that's um, right. Like a big boy. I kind of want a big boy, but, you know, I see pictures of dogs all the time, and I like dogs in all varieties. I think um, you'd love a dog. At... I think a dog would be great would. for you. Can't wait, I mean, <laughs> can't wait for the day that you tell everyone that you just got your dog and to come over and see <gasps> it. the cat. Oh, there she is. The cat. And then you go over, mm -hmm. and we all go over to your house, and then you just point to your goliath bird eating south american spider and go look at this oh you guys know what it's like five <laughs> arms pog. A dog cunt <laughs> it's just this gargoyle in the corner i think i, I want to photos of little dog of black starts, labs black starts labs barking and shit yeah you said you want you want a little dog too i think i want a little dog a little like apartment dog like a chihuahua i can like you know, I can if I'm going over to you know visit the boys. I can you know oh. he can just sit on my on my passenger seat and we can or in my lap go for a drive. Chuck it in the handbag. 
Mm -hmm. That's a good call. Like, I, I definitely am not opposed to little dogs, but I think, I don't know, oh. every time I... Oh, Swagger is showing us cat, cat footage cam. right now. Oh, yeah. Cat cam. No way. Cat cam. Cat cam. Cat cam. Cat cam. Cat cam. Oh, my God. He's getting oh, closer. Oh, my gosh. Like fucking... Oh, <gasps> oh Bring your light. Where's your phone? Go. Get your phone light so we can see. We're, we're very sorry, audio listeners. You can't see this, but... Uh, yeah, you're shit, missing you're, out, audio listeners. I'm not your phone if you're on Spotify. It should be right there. You are missing out. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Look at that. Swaggy. Swaggy shows. Hey, guys. Hey what guys, it's Swaggy Shorty. Oh <laughs> Where the frick is the cat, man? Behind the curtain. Oh, Sorry. frick. That's frick. okay. Wait. The cat cam gone. Okay, can you make the Jay. game normal then? This is kind of weird. <laughs> no, no, do the whole dude. podcast like this. <laughs> like, fuck is this? Holding like Dave. <laughs> this is like, it's That's like awesome. someone tried to unlock your iPhone. It's like a five-year-old just looks at it <laughs> like this. <laughs> Audio Love listener Swagger has picked up his, his webcam in his hand. Look how long my eyelashes are. They are long. Okay, mate. Damn, that's kind of sexy. Swagger, there's a weird thing with his eyelashes where he likes to brag about them. Um, he's very proud of them. They're very, like, feminine looking eye eyelashes, I will say. <laughs> do you use a tool to get them looking like that? No. Or are they just naturally popping? God, I know girls that are Are they just naturally eyelashes. fucking sexy? <laughs> Wait, girls, like, pluck their eyelashes? No, no way. No, 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 no. They curl them, oh, right? Some probably do. Yeah, they'll, like, trim and pluck that shit. They, they, uh, Pluck. Some tw trim and pluck. Well, they do that for eyebrows. They pluck, but uh, for eyelashes, they wear those fake ones sometimes. So they put them on. Yeah, or you, or you yeah, can get but... extensions. Mm. Mm. Like, but, uh, there's no, there's no way you pluck them. Right? Extensions no are weird. Way. They like, they, they take one lash at a time and then attach them to your other lashes. What the I wouldn't know, but. Uh, really weird. So I just really looked into this. He, he encountered this information when he was looking at bone extensions again. He just, uh, decided to get it all done at once. <laughs> Fuck. Put the it. camera back. What the fuck? Yeah, is what weird. does it bother you? Are it's you being bothered? Yeah. What so are you looking a little bothered? Your eyes are going two separate little, directions. Little, 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 little bothered. You look bothered by this? Who are you looking you look at? Who are you talking to? Talking, talking to you, to motherfucker. <laughs> you. Mason, what's new with you, buddy? <laughs> What? Yeah, what's, what's new with you? Me? I'm making a Rust server. Ooh. He's making a Rust server. So that's in the works right now. I got like, I don't know, I got like, like two guys working on it and it's going to be vanilla. But I don't know, man. I'm kind of nervous about it. It's stressing me out a bit lately. But what? You, just, you just announced it like yesterday, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> but like, I've, it's like a lot to take on, man. Oh, what enough. actually is it? Like, what is a, what is a Rust server? Is it what just it'll like, just have like it'll just be vanilla like just default yeah like every other server that's because there's modded servers like where you can hit nodes and get like three times the amount and shit like that oh right 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 and you're just gonna and, be like the owner of the server and well i won't own it because i because then people will just accuse me of like admin abusing me uh, ah right, 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 right. shit but yeah i've got like people who are gonna admin it for me how many people can yeah. it hold i'm gonna do 200 and Far. 200 for the first wipe i think Cool. It'll be pretty packed so, too if you promote it. So what's the benefit? Yeah, hopefully. What's the benefit of owning your own server? Is it just so that you could ban more, people that you know more. are hacking and shit? Uh, what do you mean? Like, like, if, so, like if someone's oh, hacking no. and like you're, you're playing normally and, and you know like someone is aimbotting and shit, you can just go ahead and ban them, right? I just want to farm content on it. Easy enough? Yeah, you're just going to make, make some videos and shit. That's fucking sick. Around. Yeah. Good, Good to see. Yeah. That's neat. How about you, Jay? What's going on with you? Yeah, it's Fortnite. been a while since I've been on the potty. Fortnite. Uh, yeah, honestly, a lot of fucking working and that's about it. And not Just a lot of going outside. Work. No, so what else can you do? Yeah, dude, he stayed inside like for the last, you know, however long. And then he, got, he still got sick. He still managed to get I don't sick. Even, yeah, and I still yeah, managed to get fuck? sick somehow. so weird. Sorry. Have you been like licking the Uber Eats bags or what? <laughs> yeah, I mean like I, I tried that, but... I don't think that's why I'm sick. Uh, you know, it's a sick cunt, I reckon. Yeah, I'm <laughs> a bit cunt. of a sick cunt, that's about it. Can't wait. Apparently, we can see if we're allowed out soon, so. Yes, oh, we good. find out Sunday. I'll be so good. I, think that, I thought it was next Sunday. No, no, it's it this Sunday. Sunday. Did we talked about this before. <laughs> oh, I don't remember. Oh. Yeah, what but yeah that'd be nice. Uh, yesterday uh, on YouTube, and my recommended, I got a Fortnite song from you, Jay. That I didn't mm. know existed. Like you didn't, you I didn't, didn't know. I had no idea about it, and I listened really? to it. And I was like, I was like, damn, this is, you know, this is pretty <laughs> good. 
<laughs> hey, thank you, thank you. It's got like 35 yeah, million it's views. It's insane. Really? Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. Going insane. fucking platinum cunt. <laughs> 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 nah, yeah, it was it was Fortnite fun. is dying one, right? Yeah, if we're nice kind of yeah. dying. Your, your most popular video to date. Damn. Yeah, it was shit talking Fortnite. That's funny. This can we we <laughs> should really acknowledge that this has been an absolutely phenomenal year for Jay and his content. Definitely he's, has. He's, I appreciate crushed, that. he's crushed it. He's been yeah. grinding and he's got so many videos out this year with like ten mil plus views, it's ridiculous. You're yeah. the most subscribed to Misfit, and it's very uh, good to see you succeeding and doing so well, buddy. Thank Great. you very much, guys. Right, Thank boys. you very much. I've been working very hard, and I'm, I'm keen to hard. take a break soon. That's <laughs> <me>. <laughs> very excited for a break. Oh, I'm so eager for the first boys trip after all this is over. It'll yes, I can't fucking wait. Yeah. <sighs> Fuck. But, you know, we don't want to fucking... Where are we going, boys? Where are we going? Let's go overseas, <laughs> kind of, if we can. Let's like... go to Thailand <laughs> for no one. particular reason. <laughs> Let's go to Thailand. Jason's I'm down Thailand. 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 Yeah, fucking oath, play some pool with some hookers. <laughs> Take it down for the pussies <laughs> up on the whole yeah. bits. Oh, you know, I'm that's down. how that's how you I want to shoot an AK. They, you know they do that? When you yeah. when you play with when you play with hookers in pool like in Thailand. That's how I got so good because I always played them with hookers down there. Yeah. They like they like <laughs> put their their rude bits Mm. Up like to the pocket holes, oh. and like they like put you off by doing that. Oh, they like do that. what? And like, what? How they do that? They position like doggy style position, like leaning over. No, the like hole? straight up, like just leg oh, up. Okay, just just... fucking straight up. And like me and Kobe were like probably like thirteen when they were doing this. <laughs> shit. Oh my god! <laughs> Incredible. Jesus. Incredible Jesus. early exposure to the human, the oh. female anatomy. Uh, oh yeah, quite, quite, quite the amount. <laughs> Wait, so they were women or men? <laughs> women. Uh, who knows? Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Anything goes. Nah, I think they were women. I think you they think? were. Oh my god. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? You were 13. What else oh. can you remember from Thailand, miss? Anything else come to mind when you think of Thailand? Uh, well, I want to go to a ping pong show. Yeah, oh, yeah, one of those. That would be cool. I really, because Kobe went to one last time, he went with his mate, and yeah. I didn't get to see one, so. What's right. a ping pong show? Mm. They oh, shoot mate. ping pong balls out of somewhere. Is it like ping, wait, is it ping pong, like a tournament? Yeah, kind of. yeah, 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 it's a ping pong tournament. Yeah. Yeah, kind oh, of. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize Thailand people were so good at ping pong. Yeah, yeah. they are. Mace, would you get her elaborate? Well, a lot, well, a lot, sure? of, the, a lot uh, of the players in those tournaments are, are, are real pussies. Um, mm, oh, really? Yeah. But Why? it's just still really entertaining. <laughs> mm, yeah, yeah, that shit's popping, man. That's great. <laughs> Bro, they the shoot the ping pong balls out somewhere, man. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? How do they, they shoot... Why they shoot darts into balloons and stuff like that? Pull darts. out birds, you name pull it. They do. Pull out birds. What are you about, bro? <laughs> yeah, man. they do it, man. That they do it. Fake. What? No, it's not. As if they're pulling birds out their vaginas. I, I, swear, I swear. If, if she's got a bush, Fuck. it's Harry Houdini, dude. Holy <laughs> shit, David Blaine in this shit. <laughs> Instead oh, of vomiting oh. frogs, he's <laughs> he pulls a frogs. fucking frog out of his pussy. Speaking <laughs> of David Blaine. <laughs> Did oh, any yeah. of you guys <laughs> watch his weird shit skydiving thing that he did? Yeah, that it was wasn't that weird was shit uh, skydiving What thing. the fuck, dude? That was, that was, was an achievement. Magic, by the no, way. No, it wasn't. Yeah, he did a skydiving. Why are you being so dude, it was not does, magic. He doesn't so think weird. it's magic, Toby. You're it was retard. a stunt, Toby. It's, it's a stunt. so weird. Dude, what? he tied himself up to some balloons and then jumped off with a parachute. Yeah, yeah what he the went fuck? up in an experimental cringe. aircraft. He had to get skydiving certified. He had to learn how to pilot both a helium, you know, a gas balloon and a hot air balloon. He went through so much shit, and that was a real achievement, dude. They had to license mm. that aircraft as a, uh, uh, like, like a fucking experimental aircraft. They had to get clearance to go into Class A airspace, which is where jetliners fly. And the entire he went up 16,000 feet. Uh, with without an oxygen supply, he hyperventilated so that he could bring his oxygen back up, so he didn't get hypoxia. So that mm. was the feat, like that was the magic that he didn't have oxygen until he was like that high up. Yeah, let's let's just get like a brief like overall explanation of what he did for anyone who is uninformed. It's David Blaine. He's a notorious street uh, uh, magician and like stunt extraordinaire. And this is his latest stunt where he basically. Uh, filled up a bunch of weather balloons with helium am i right and uh um, yep like latex balloons with helium and went up into the sky i'm not sure how many feet up he went 
unattached to anything. He was just he was just hanging on, right? Like, no, 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 no. He was attached. He, totally up he was attached to it. What? I thought he attached his safety like like up halfway halfway through. Or am I crazy? No, no. That was when um, he uh, when he was taking the parachute. I think he still had to. He had to be hanging on though, because only after he no, attached the he safety was, could he, he was let holding, go and put his yeah, parachute. Yeah, he on. was he was holding on to the parachute, um, like the the line of the parachute. So the parachute right. was sus- suspended by like a uh, a rope. And if he let mm-hmm. go of the rope, it'd fall down and he'd be dead. Uh, so like, mm-hmm. it was always hold on uh, to the safety. So like, you know, he was just hanging right. on to it the entire time until he had to pull it down, take the chute off, and then he could go hands free. But he was attached to a harness. Right. Okay. Of course. Yeah. So he goes up and he puts the parachute on midair, gets up to, did you say 16,000 feet? No, 16,000 uh, feet is when he used uh, the O2. I think he went up to like uh, right. 25, it was like 20, almost 25,000. Yeah. Yeah, it was before he like dropped, which is a yeah, before he jumped. Shit. Yeah, I watched the entire thing, um, and I will say I get where Toby's coming from because it's one of those things where it's very technically impressive, but was v- like visually not super. Yeah, tight. I'm not. I'm not uh, saying it wasn't like impressive what he did. It was just a bit boring. <laughs> well, I thought it was cool. I thought it was really cool. A lot really of people compare it. it to the uh, the Red Bull stunt um, a couple years back, where he actually which went. was way cooler. Yeah, well, well he went it was, to the it edge was of way space. cooler, but it was also like people remember that because of the edited down video. You know, like you're not watching a live stream of that for a fucking an hour and a half. You know, like which is what this was. It was was it live stream the Red Bull thing? I forget. Uh, I, I don't video, think so. Maybe it was, it was on was. TV. I remember seeing it on TV. It was a live right. event at some point. That was definitely visually more spectacular because you actually he went into fucking outer space pretty much, right? Like he was yeah, really but he was in a full on suit. Absolutely, absolutely, and that's when it comes down to this thing where David Blaine's stunt was actually like really technically remarkable, but didn't look as cool because I don't know. It's a clear sunny day. He's just up in the sky with some big balloons and he skydives. It's kind of like yeah, exactly. What the uninformed person is gonna think that the stunt was? Yeah, but he had uh, but he had course, he had no cool idea zone. where he was gonna land. He had you know the original landing area. Uh, he mm-hmm. wasn't able to make, so he had to completely improvise that on terrain that he wasn't trained to do. Pretty crazy, mm-hmm. man. It was pretty fucking pretty intense. The thing I like, and if you want to pull stunts like that. On games, you should get your game assault. <laughs> oh, wow. oh, oh, what a GG. Wow. Code Misfits. Game assault. GG. Code Misfits. Off. If you want to pull stunts like that on oh, games, yeah, you can do flavor it. Flavor too. Mango. Yeah, well, yeah new, talking about the new, new flavor. flavor, dude. Have you mango. Guys it? I haven't yeah, tasted it, but flavor. it looks fucking I fire. Tasted I've tasted another it, flavor that's in the works that maybe we shouldn't mm. talk about yet, but that. Yeah, yeah. I can personally yeah. vouch for the secret flavor. Mm, yes. yes, it's very delicious. The secret episode. formula, secret. yeah, the Krabby Patty secret, secret formula. formula, but on Gamer Subs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Gamer Subs like DC code it's just burger flavored, burger flavored subs. <laughs> burger That'd be amazing. Subs. Burger subs, burger subs. So can we get like a salmon flavored G subs? That'd be amazing. Oh, the, the thing yeah. I like about David Blaine is that he's so clearly just an absolute enthusiast for what he does. Like he he doesn't really try and look cool. He's not like over hyping himself or like trying to be like a crazy stunt man he's nervous yeah. he's yeah. genuinely nervous and excited for this thing like worried concerned making sure that everything goes right like he just this guy just loves stunts and he loves uh magic tricks um and i don't know i think it's really cool to see i really saw that when i watched him on the um joe rogan podcast yeah. and just listening to him fucking almost yeah. manically talk about you know houdini and his inspirations and his past stunts it's kind of cool to see um, that's sick but yeah the ascension things definitely worth checking out it was cool yeah it was a very it was very freaky for a while it was, was tense up. very tense i, mm. I kind of been the only person like hoping slash not hoping that he like something went wrong obviously i hope that he survived I've, but i was I feel like, like everyone sure. feel, it's human nature to feel like that <laughs> i was like surely something interesting happens and he like slips but then catches himself or like uh-huh. falls but like but then the parachute on midair while falling and you know i was hoping for something like that like but then out of NASCAR nowhere like, crashes and shit What's yeah. the hawk comes along and snatches him away? They had <laughs> a no way comes the fire. They had like a bunch of uh, <laughs> countermeasures. They had like a bunch of ballast, like uh, sandbags that weighed like five and a half pounds each. So if mm. one of the balloons popped he, and he started to go down, then he could simply just offload the sandbag and drop weight and then he would go higher up. So like the actual mm. engineering of their, you know, because it was like a legitimate experimental aircraft. 52 yeah. balloons, 52 cards in a deck, which I think was what they were going for. Uh, oh. 
But yeah, so it fucking went right up. Did you guys know, like, of all the stunts that he did, it all spells out, I think, Blaine? Or, or really? like David Blaine or something like that? Like, all the stunts that, that he did spells out his name. Oh. And Ascension Wait, is, really? like the, is like the A. Yeah. Oh, so but he there's no and in an E to do still. There's no B in Ascension though. No, no, no. Because he, he, he did, he did like <laughs> no, he That's did. He it's an abbreviation. He did. Um, he did like what, what you think. know. He did the electricity one. He did the um the one underwater where he was encased in ice. Breath. The one where he was underwater. The one where he was on a giant pole and fell into cardboard boxes. And the titles of all of those, I uh, spell out oh. his name. So this was like it's his magnum opus. Sick. It's so cool and interesting that we still have people like David Blaine that I was like, you know what? I'm going to be a stunt man. I'm just going to take my time to put hours and hours into learning yeah. this. And I'm going to do a crazy freak stunt for p human entertainment. Like, it's kind of cool, I think. To yeah, like the last, I, like I feel like the last one I remember is Chris Angel. Yeah, <laughs> Chris Angel. Angel. What happened to him? He's, his stunts were all real. I'm going to Google that. <laughs> <laughs> Mind freak. I, I don't know much about uh, Chris Angel. I remember like, Bro, the he show walked on being water. On. He was Jesus. Yeah, I think people he's a just mind lost freak. interest in his fake bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's he's fifty two. Weird goth appearance. Chris Angel is fifty two years old now. Mind freak. Yeah, yeah. that's insane. Yeah, it, was, it was pretty entertaining, but nah, all fake and trash. <laughs> is it? Was it all fake? Yeah, no, I don't yeah. care. He's like, discrediting everything he's done. He's pretty. He claimed um, it was all magic and shit. He's pretty like seen as a joke in the in that sort of community the mind freak yeah. live illusionist was rushed into the hospital after losing consciousness during a stunt in which he hung from his ankles in a straitjacket the famed music magician had a brush with death during rehearsal for his upcoming stunt what the fuck i looked up what happened to chris angel <laughs> it's clearly a <laughs> common search <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, yeah, apparently, written by Chris Angel. Apparently, in, according to an article in 2017, he just passed out during one of his acts. Shame. Maybe, uh, maybe he has not returned since. I need more yeah. attention. I'm becoming less relevant. <laughs> Bruh. Yeah. Is, David, I David Blaine <laughs> uh, had a run in with that, I think, a couple of times. But he did the one where he was in a box and he water fasted for like 44 days. So he, he didn't water he, fast. Yeah. So he put on a bunch of weight. I'm pretty sure. So he got he got rather chunky, and then he just water fasted. Had nothing but water in a in a in a glass box. Uh, I think in New York somewhere. So everyone could see him, and he was up there for 44 days just chugging water. And then I uh, after what the fuck? And, and, and no one could believe it. And then a doctor, uh, like the, the physician that he had. I uh, thought that he cheated was like, there's no way like this is all magic. Like he had to have cheated. He had to have eaten something. So they gave him nutrient filled IV uh, and it put him into shock and he almost died. Uh, because, oh, yeah. Oh, and, and then, and then him and the doctor ended up co-writing a paper uh, of a study uh, for, for, you know, how to like rehabilitate somebody that went through uh, a 44 day fast. Uh, so it was really mm. interesting. Pretty cool pushing the human body like that. Yeah, like dude. It's, it's yeah. good that there are people willing to do that stuff because it's interesting as hell. Like, uh, I don't know how that would ever be actually applied in a scientific sense or a medical sense, but that's dope. Mm. That's dope. What's the longest you guys have gone without eating? 10 days water what? fast. Mm. You've done a 10 day water fast? Yeah, yeah. We've yeah. talked, about, this, talked we? about it before. That's right. I, that's like, yeah. kind of shocking. Yeah. Um, how, how, how was that again? Like, and not good <laughs> yeah, like <laughs> you just all you can think about is food like when yeah. you're not actually trained to do it i assume did you lose a ton of weight or or what yeah i think it was like 12 15 kilos around about Damn. what yeah oh. would you do it, it again? not good no, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> what, what was the what was the first meal like after that I, I like had Pringles or something. <laughs> Pringles? <laughs> it was, like, <laughs> yeah. was that just the thing you'd been craving? This is what made you crave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And then, yeah, no, it was not good. Not good. Fuck. Not were, you still, were you still making videos during that time? No, that was a very bad stage in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say. Like, fuck, if Jay was making videos during a... How long? Seven day? Five Ten? days? Ten days. Ten days. Ten <laughs> days? What a fast. Yeah. I really got no excuse. Fuck it out. It Guys, was, yeah. Would you rather take a, a a cold shower on a hot summer day, or would you rather be wrapped in a warm blanket on a cold winter day? Warm Seems blanket. Warm blanket. Warm blanket. Yeah, warm blanket. I think cold warm shower. Blanket. Toby's going for cold shower, Mace. I, yeah, cold yeah, shower. So refreshing. So refreshing. Yeah. Three for warm blanket. I 
am going to say cold shower too. Main, only for the reason that I would rather be like in a hot summer's day than a cold winter's day. And the cold shower is just like... It's fair. I don't know. It still implies that you're there on a hot summer's day, right? Yeah. Speaking yeah, of uh, like being <laughs> under blanket on a cold winter's day, uh, <laughs> yeah. I Twitch recently intro- uh, introduced in Australia and New Zealand. It's been around in America for a while. Uh, watch parties where you can oh. watch uh, Amazon Prime video uh, like movies and shit with your Twitch chat. And like you, you, you basically just stream your webcam and then your webcam goes above the chat. And then the whole screen where the stream would normally be is just the show or the movie. Oh, easy and you can just watch. Yeah, it's sick. The <laughs> only thing is, uh, I realized that um, people can like still watch. You, it still says you're live, and people can still watch your streams even if they don't have Amazon Prime Video, which means all they see is your webcam. So they, if they don't know what's going on, <laughs> oh, you're just sitting there oh. silent with a webcam on. Every now and again, like <laughs> reacting to the something. Guys, so they funny. need Prime Video. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. Mm. Oh, okay. Because yeah, otherwise, it would have been like you know, it'd be illegal. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But it's pretty sick. Although the like that problem, I hate. And also, uh, I found out the other day when I went to try use it for the first time. Um, every country's Amazon Prime Video library is different, and. I didn't think about the fact that that would mean that if I wanted to watch a movie, there would be people in chat being like, ah, damn, it's not available in America or whatever. That's what, so like, get a if, VPN. Yeah, if it's not available for them, they can't watch it. Isn't the selection also pretty mediocre, I've heard? Uh, it's in not. general. It's not amazing. It's okay. Mm. There's like... And what? People, people still can sub and like interact with the stream as normal? Like yeah. Doing that? Yeah. That's uh, crazy. That's crazy. I guess that's that, yeah, a natural byproduct of Amazon owning Twitch, right? <laughs> Yeah, Damn. I think it's it's a thing that could be really cool, but at the moment has issues that kind of putting me off. But um, yeah, it could be really cool if it if it's kind of like ironed out. Hmm. I feel like the free movies everyone should be able to watch. You can watch all the prime have... originals. Like everyone can, or yeah. So like things like the Grand That's Tour cool. and like Carnival Row and all those like original Amazon shows. That there are some pretty good ones. You can watch those and the boys. I was watching yeah. the boys season two. Oh, I need to, I need to watch today. that. It came out yeah, today. Same here. Three episodes. Shit, that's the superhero oh, one. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. I've been getting in a trailer park, boys. That shit's pretty. Oh, funny. It's so good. <laughs> that's, that shit's fucking hilarious. Oh, yeah. I you were telling me What's his name? That. Fucking Bubbles. Yeah. Is that his name? Bubbles. Yeah, <laughs> he's a piss art. dude. Because like there was a cartoon one. Where the cartoon, because I, I started off watching the cartoon one, and there was this one episode where like one of the guys is like talking, and it's like where they f- smoke weed for the first time when they were like kids, like super young, and this guy's like talking in it. His name's Ricky, and it's like <laughs> he doesn't, he has like the most broken English I've ever heard, but it's like American, and it just made me lose my. You're like Canadian. I, I can't. It was like yeah, Canadian, yeah, and it was like. I can't explain it. It was just the way he said shit was fucking hilarious. <laughs> I gotta recommend it. It's fucking funny. Uh, so I finally just finished uh, watching Chernobyl. Uh, oh shit! Oh, yeah, I've seen that yet. That. that that show is worth a watch. It's fucking. It's <sighs> sick. It's uh. Yeah. It's definitely grim as fuck because it's going over a horrific disaster in uh, human history. It's fucking Russians, it's worth man. Fucking watch it. It's, it's good ass television. What's that? Yeah, on? it's crazy. Jesus it's it's actually Christ. quite a good. T- uh, HBO, it's an I HBO think? show. I, I didn't watch it um, entirely yeah. legally, I don't think. <laughs> but um, <laughs> but uh, it's interesting seeing the parallel like now dealing with COVID. And, you know, obviously there's a lot of um, politics getting in the way of, of COVID in certain areas in particular. And, you know, like government just not listening to scientists and things like that. Um, which is exactly what happened back in the Chernobyl disaster. And it's just sort of like, yeah, dude. I don't know. They, that that could have been even more catastrophic dude. than it was. The entirety yeah. of Europe could have been fucked by that. Yep. Could have um, gone into the ground one. Se- centuries. Yeah, man. Dude, they, it's a brave man. They, yeah, well, you know, you have a gun held to your head and said, okay, well, we sent in a robot to clean up this radioactive waste, but it, it was fucking gun, it, destroyed. It wasn't, it wasn't a gun held to their head. But, well, uh, dude, if they fucking, if they, def- they said no, like, what do you think was going to happen? They were going to go right to fucking Siberia. Go right to a gulag. True. True. No, I think they told them, like, they promised Wait, their families they'd be taken care of and yeah, shit when they sent them in. Like, there's that incentive, dude, but, like, you know, 
But after all those people went and cleaned up, like those were some brave motherfuckers, dude. Because like they went into, mm-hmm. they like they they went in with fucking shovels and shit, and they <laughs> fucking the cleaned so, up ways. Ju- ju- just for context, like the Chernobyl disaster is obviously like the um the core of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant, uh, like exploded, it was meltdown, and was exposed basically. It was a yeah a huge nuclear meltdown. Um, and there was graphite and toxic material all over the roof and that needed to be cleaned up and, um, and, uh, yeah, the only way to get it done because they would, they would try some machines up there to do it so that no one would get harmed, but the machines, the radiation radiation was causing the technology to fry. Um, and so they had to find like maybe 200 people to like line up and go like in groups of three or four out on the roof at a time for a maximum of 90 seconds what uh, the that, fuck? Because that was the only amount of time they could be that close to the core, picking up gra- uh, graphite with shovels and tossing it down into the where the core had exploded. Um, they had 90 seconds to get in, get out before they were basically they're fucking dead. Like they'll be dead that yeah. day if they stayed longer than radiation. That. Um, and obviously, everyone who it was even anywhere near this uh, died of you know cancer or other uh, yeah or just you know, the af- radiation itself you know, afterwards like, within like the next year or to five yeah, years like, like fuck. they 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 sent all those workers out to different parts of russia and then they all just started dying cancer cancer mm-hmm. you know that kind of thing but dude like yeah. then they had the elephant's foot um which is the the giant core that melted down and uh if you looked at it mm-hmm. like if you looked at it You're you, blind, you no, right? you just die Lethal dose, oh, re- like a shit. lethal dose of radiation. Lethal. You, you fucking, it literally breaks you down on like a molecular, yeah. molecular level. It, like it fucking your DNA tears gone. apart your DNA. The How very the fuck fabric. is this shit like that that exists? It, That's it's, so it's, radiation. Radiation. it's just radiation. It's <laughs> everywhere. What the fuck? Like no, just, the, the, you know, you can get radiation, radiation from the sun. You know, yeah. You know, if you're like, out in space, dude, cancer. you'll get irradiated. Yeah, it's crazy, man. It's like the way they described it in the show was like um. Like little molecular bullets, they just tear through the very fabric of reality. Holy it's fuck! It's fucking insane. That's um, like Neil deGrasse Tyson shit. <laughs> 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 yeah, something like that. Something like that. Anyway, yeah, that's just something that I. That's mean, crazy. I'm gonna watch it's it. A real in, it's cool a real shit. insidious fucking thing. That radiation. Yeah, it's man, like I. My dad would tell me that you know there's nuclear reactors that they have on. Uh, uh, on actual aircraft carriers because that's what powers them and, I, mm, and I'm, really? yeah, I'm pretty sure i uh, he told i could be wrong on this but i'm pretty sure he told me that i uh, like you know they'll have the the reactor on and the radiation will shoot straight up into the air um mm-hmm. and people on jets they want to land on the aircraft carrier like they have to signal a call in be like hey turn off the the nuclear reactor because i'm coming down mm-hmm. and you know th- th- there was a pilot that was flying over ready to land and he and he tasted a lot of metal uh, in his mouth, ah, and he and he was like, yikes. and he and he radioed in. He's like, is the fu- is the reactor off? And then they're like, oh, oh no, sorry. And they turned it off, and then he oh was able God. to land. But it was just like, you know, Jesus fucking Christ. How much was he exposed to in that brief? Period? I, I I don't really know, but I don't think too much. Oh I think I think it would have just been minor, minor like throwing up, headaches kind of thing. Dude, that's that radi- crazy. That radiation poisoning is fucking gnarly, man. Yeah, like, dude. The the what it does to your body like it looks just like insanely severe burns yeah your skin like, turns to goo mm-hmm. some Ooh, hulk type ooh, shit <laughs> some hulk, hulk type shit in what way <laughs> what makes I you think know. of hulk <laughs> i don't know just like the dna Green. cells and shit like breaking and all that <laughs> yeah, wasn't the hulk i uh, wasn't he formed because he was blasted with gamma rays or, or is that another thing oh yeah I think it was gamma yeah. rays. Is that why he's green? Yeah. Because gamma is no, because yeah, gamma starts with a G. Gamma's green. Yeah. <laughs> it's gamma green. I was thinking yeah. of the gamma knife from uh, what's uh, it called? CSGO. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. Well, uh, Fuck. By the way, you said something about a gulag, and like I know gulags are real, but what were gu- actual gulags? They're like, like what uh, are they actual? They're like work camps. The gulag archipelago. It's like a fucking. But what actually did they it's do? A, it's a government agency. In charge of the Soviet um, network of forced labor camps set up by order of Vladimir Lenin, reaching its peak during Joseph Stalin's rule from the 1930s to the early 1950s. That is communism, my friends. Right, so it's nothing to do with 
Warzone. No, no, well, like, that's no. not the same at all. No, well, no. no, Warzone is just like it's just a map know, using it. It's like the prison. Yeah, I thought they had to like one v one in there or something. Mm -mm. <laughs> <the> prison. <laughs> no. I was like dead no. serious. That's actually what I thought. I thought no. they'd have to like fight each other. Unfortunately, Call of Duty is isn't exactly an accurate representation no. of history all the time. <laughs> Fuck, bro. Why would they yeah. call it a gulag then? Bastards. <laughs> it's just a big change prison. It. Yeah. Jesus Christ. That's crazy. Russian history is super interesting. I really want to learn more about it. Um, yeah, it's, it's fucking important. crazy, dude. Hell of a place. Russians, oh, Russians have been there. through the ringer, man. Been through the fucking oh, ringer. Sure. I feel so bad for the fucking Russian people all throughout history. It's just, yeah, Jesus Christ. And it's so big, too. Russia's a fucking massive so place. So yeah, much of it's harsh. unpopulated, though, right? Yeah. A lot of mm, like, could you imagine if it was here. all populated? Holy, <laughs> holy! Well, yeah, just think of China, you know, so fucking big ass country, heavily populated. Yeah, but Same. Russia's like twice the size. I actually don't know how big it is. It's like, have it's you guys? The, it's the opposite of Australia. Australia's like big and like empty desert. That place is big and empty, just like snow Ice and shit. It's, yeah, it's a much. different kind of desert. It's a different kind of uninhabitable. The tundra. You know, like, tundra. There's winter yeah. tundra. You know, Antarctica is cool like a desert in the sense that it never precipitates. Like, there's never any rain. There's never any snow. It's the driest continent. It's covered in ice. Mm. Why are we trying to move to Mars when we can just go to, like, Russia and shit? <laughs> exactly. As, so as Elon. Australia, bro. There's so much so space much out here. So much unused Elon, space, let's shoot like... some rockets over to Russia and colonize. What could go wrong? Yeah, maybe, like, that'd be <sighs> sick. You start going to DEFCON 1. No, nah, Vladimir Putin would not be happy about that. I can tell you that much. Oh, you reckon? Yeah. Shit. I don't know. Who knows what makes that guy happy? Maybe the strangest things bring a smile to Putin's face. Maybe he I mean, like, he likes, likes riding horses shirtless. Mm. And bears. Mm. Really yeah. bears, and, bears. and sticking his daughter with a coronavirus vaccine. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> think he actually did that? No way. Not himself personally, but he said his daughter got the vaccine. No. Yeah, I know, but like I'm that's some like villain in like the movies kind of shit. He's like, "Give me the vaccine, fucking like into their own." I'll kid. take like, the vaccine. Jesus. Well, you guys know what's a good show? What the Office? Cool. I've been uh, watching the Office uh, US. Uh, I've it's so been good to, to watch that all the way through. All the American yeah. listeners are probably all at once in unison, like, "No shit!" <laughs> no, like it's actually good. As I put off watching it for so long, but yeah, it's a good show. It's a good show. Would yeah. heavily recommend it. Yeah, it's one of those quality basics, right? You know, like mm. that's, that's a widely it's one of those celebrated like show. Staple ones. It's like, uh, what would you call it? I don't want to say it's like the next Seinfeld or something. It's the like white that. girl like Tinder show. Friends, the it's like Family Guy. Yeah, it's like very big in like pop culture and shit. Like everyone knows who it is. <laughs> Did you say it's yeah. like Family Guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's American. It's kind of like okay. a mix of Chernobyl and Family yeah. Guy. In my opinion. Yeah, it's like kind of like that sort of dynamic. <laughs> <clears throat> Nah, but it's good as. I would definitely recommend watching it. Have you guys ever seen those maps of how much space countries actually take up? Like oh, it's, yeah. it's yeah. You know, like a globe. Oh, is yeah. Group. Africa's yeah. fucking massive. Africa's huge. Yeah. Africa's huge. Yeah. I I'm haven't seen it. What I'm talking about, I'm trying, I'm trying to find the picture I saw. I only saw it a couple of weeks yeah, ago. Because, but it's like, imagine the world just got flattened out and like you could actually see. Because the flat. globe distorts <laughs> how big countries actually are because yeah. you're looking at like a round It's like called the Mercurial projection or some shit like that. Oh my God. Okay, okay you just made that word name. up, Matt. You just made that word up. Where it shows like all the <laughs> countries. I think that's like uh -huh. the globe one. Or it's like where it takes the globe and tries yeah. to put it on the flat. On yeah. Like a map. They don't even Plus need to do that though. It's already flat. I can't find this fucking picture for the life of me, but maybe... Yeah, I'm trying to Google post. it too. What the hell do you call it? Either way, it's cool as shit and countries are way fucking bigger oh, than Oh, wait, expect. wait, wait. Here's yeah, one. and some countries are way fucking smaller than they look. Mm. Here Greenland. Here's one. Yeah. New Zealand. Look at that. Well, There's Africa, size of Africa compared to everything else. Yeah. Wait, Japan's actually that little? Yeah. Yeah, Japan's like the east coast of the US. Holy heck. Japan is about the size of New Zealand, yeah. Um, really what the fuck aren't there like 80 billion people there there's a lot of people but it's heavily populated only in certain areas like rural japan is, is really? quite quiet. most fuck. of the population resides here on the t tokyo area and then a couple places up north i think crazy oh the uk is God. the size of Madagascar. the uk is tiny it's a good movie fuck. yeah no wonder everyone there is fucking you know what i'm not gonna say that one. i love melman <laughs> from madagascar <laughs> you love who Melman. Melman. The draft. Yeah. Oh. Melman the draft. From Madagascar. Yeah. David Schwimmer plays him. 
And David well, I, the, I know that because his last name is really cool to say. <laughs> we should rewatch Madagascar. <laughs> what a stacked cast. What a fun uh, It movie. is. It's got fucking. I like the lemurs. The lemurs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Old, old what's his name? Yeah. Oh, man. That was one of those movies that really brought joy to me as a child. Madagascar Same. was. Yeah. What a yeah. Fun, fun fucking Madagascar film. 2 Escape to Africa is also the another PS, good one. The PS2 game as well. I don't know if anyone played it. No. no. Yeah. Oh, I miss being oh, a was kid. Good. <laughs> Yeah, man. Being a kid was easy. Like, I'm man. not even that old, but I feel like I just miss being a kid. Yeah. <sighs> Nothing brings me joy anymore. I'm sick of being an adult. Get me like, out this of this sucks. world. Yeah, like <laughs> this sucks. This <laughs> sucks. Yeah. But now you can buy all the toys you want, bro. Look at it that way. You have like the biggest True. allowance in the world. <laughs> That's fucking shit ass. <laughs> I toys aren't want, even cool doesn't anymore. Doesn't even want the toys anymore, dude. Yeah, I Fuck. don't want them. I wanted them back then. Yeah, he just wants that me. raw childhood wonder. Just inject that into his veins. Yeah. Yo, hook me up to, yo, if they ever make nostalgia into a drug, fucking hook me up to an IV drip of that shit. Just the adult oh, Swagger's vaccine. disappeared. Swagger's left the show. He did um, just too like, emotional like, about he just, that. Yeah, he just had like a life-defining <laughs> moment. He's like, "Fuck this shit. I'm done, boys. I'm going yeah, back well, to the kid." What, Swag is like pushing 40 now? Like, oh yeah, my dude. god, he's oh, getting no. up there. Like, Fuck, at some point, we are going to lose him. Being friends with Swag is kind of like getting the dog. It's like, oh man, I'm just going to be sad in like 10 years when it dies. <laughs> I know, man. <laughs> he's pushing 40 now. Like, he ain't got long left. It's crazy. <laughs> yeah. He got I the know. cat and the kitten to make him feel young again. Oh shit, it's all starting to make sense now. I just wish man. they didn't have to wear the mask because he's ashamed of his wrinkles. You know, I think he looks yeah. bold and old and cool. Right. And, yeah, I think he looks uh, awesome. Like the gray hair and stuff. It does like, look yeah, a little bit like a scrotum. Him. A little bit. But, a little you know, bit. A little there's little nothing bit. wrong with a slight scrotious uh, appearance. Yeah. Scrotious Maximus. It's not that lopsided. <laughs> My nah. favorite feature is these big nose hairs. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, hey. Oh, what just happened? What's up? <laughs> I have no idea. Hello. He's back. What happened? What? Did everyone get that too? <laughs> I got yeah. that. What happened? Uh, what, what the fuck? I have no idea here? what happened. And my box ran yeah, out of data. Oh, we were just talking about your giant uh, nose hairs. Yeah, can we what? see? Can you like show us? And your scrotum like mean? face. Mason was just saying his favorite feature of yours is your long, long nose hairs. Oh yeah, no, nah, no, nah, I plucked those fishes like last week. Oh, you got them. Were they favorite feature gone? Were they gray or were they? No, 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 jet black. Uh, totally okay. gray. Yeah. That's okay, buddy. We get it. You're old. A few more years left, guys. We're good. You could be yourself around us. Like we don't mind. Yeah. You don't use that touch of gray or just for men shit. No. Okay, now he's all upset with me. He hates when we talk about his age. Uh. Swagger, is there anything that you wanted to talk about on the show before we wrap up here? <laughs> no. I really. Okay. Hey, always it. wrap up. Always wrap up. Always wrap Keep up. Keep it, yeah. it wrapped. Keep it wrapped. Anyone else got yeah. anything they want to discuss? Anything they want to project into the void that is the internet before we go? Yeah, maybe politics, I reckon. Yeah, religion. <laughs> Let's get into that. Let's talk about politics. Let's go, boys. <laughs> Why not? Yeah. Uh, politics, um, abortion, religion, um, mm. and race. Yeah. Yeah, let's get into all it. that good uh, stuff. All that good. All stuff. that good stuff. Yeah. Who do you uh, think no. would make an awesome president? I reckon Adam Sandler would. <laughs> yeah, Adam Sandler Shit, would because, yeah. like, yeah, America kind of is yeah. just a bad movie. Uh, I think Tim you know. Allen. <laughs> <laughs> Tim <laughs> Allen. I Tim think Allen Chris Angel. at the briefing and he yeah. gives him like bad Chris news. Angel. Tim Allen's just like, huh. <laughs> uh, David sure, sure the Russians the are launching the nukes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Surely David, David Dobrik. Mm, David nah. Dobrik for president. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my country. Seat <laughs> <laughs> Geek is an app that lets you buy tickets in literally the easiest way possible. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. Who do you reckon should be president, Mason? Uh, hmm. Um, <laughs> I think. Me. Oh yeah. Yeah. You're not even Woo. American, man. And what's your That's first? Like what's your first act as president? Stay inside till Corona's gone. Aye. Naughty boys. Yeah. Holy You're shit! Planet, what a genius. What a genius. I don't know, man. I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> Mason I don't know for president. I'm gonna make you president, man. Nah, you would. You <laughs> would. Be great. This your 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 run is looking really strong right now. Imagine this is you like at the debate. Like, I don't know if I'm good. Uh, I don't know if I'm the right uh, choice. Like I'm pretty fucking shit at man. this. Oh, I love his honesty. I'm voting for that like, guy. <laughs> the only That's honest Trump politician. Because <laughs> Trump's okay. honest as. Oh yeah. All right. Yeah. I'm gonna stop oh, yeah. that. Stop. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. oh yeah. I'm All just right, gonna guys. cut me off. Cut me off. Tune We're in. Go tune now. in next week. 
when we're going to get even deeper into politics, race, and religion. Mm. Yeah, you guys yes, you don't want to miss that one. Smart guys talking about smart things. Yeah. Yeah, this has been the Misfits yeah. podcast. Eat Gamer Subs. <laughs> Use yep, code Misfits. Gamer Subs. Gamer Subs. Snort PG. Gamer Subs. Or you can drink it. I you can drink it. it. Yeah, Consume it however you want. Just purchase it, please. Mm-hmm. If it's hot, you can make a Gamer Subs slushy. Mm. Oh. Highly accurate. Saw yeah, someone do that. Wow. It looks good. It does look good. Okay. You look good yeah, too, dude, audience. Make, I hope you're staying sane out there. We look, you look amazing. You look fantastic. Uh, I like your nose. Nose. Bye. 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 Bye.